Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Excel Bytes with today's Excel blog post. Today we're going to take a look at an easy way to compare two data ranges and see row by row if there are any differences in those two sets. And we're going to use the go to special command to help us do that. So let's see how we can easily accomplish this in Excel. So here we have two sets of data and they basically look identical but when I scroll down to the bottom I can see that my inventory 111.759, 111.676, the cost value and the sell price value are just slightly off so there must be some differences in here and I don't want to go through each line by line to try to find those so I want to use the go to command and the special option there to find those differences easily. Now when using this you can only compare two columns at a time but after you do that first set the subsequent pairs are a little easier to uh, compare. Is I'm just going to compare three columns of data. Uh, the description column, location, and inventory. So I'm going to highlight the description column and after I've done that I hold down my control key click on the heading here and hit control shift down arrow so now I have both the descriptions highlighted so what I'm going to do now is hit my F5 key that brings up the go to box I'm going to hit the special key or use the keyboard shortcut alt s and then I'm going to select row differences that I can use the keyboard shortcut alt w and once I hit OK, notice that Excel has highlighted two cells, B7 and B9. And it's saying these are different when comparing those rows to the second set of data. So you can see here it says stock molding. The problem here is we spelled molding wrong, M-O-U-L-D versus M-O-L-D. It's a difference, so Excel has highlighted that. Here I have wire harness and in the right set I have roto casing so that's definitely a difference now what I'm going to do while I have those still highlighted is I'm going to hold down my control key click on location and hit control shift down arrow and then again hold my control key click on location in the second set control shift down arrow now once I've done that all I need to do is hit the F4 key and Excel has highlighted the differences in the location in column C versus column L. Here it says New Orleans, there it says Austin. Here Tulsa, there New Orleans. Again, it found a couple differences. I'm going to do one more, so again, hold down the control key, click on inventory, control shift down arrow, hold my control key, click on inventory, control shift down arrow, and again hit F4 and now Excel has found a couple more differences. Notice I have an inventory of 1852 where in the right side it has 1906. Here 995 and in the right set 858. So all I need to do from this point is go up to my fill color command and click on whatever color I want to do and Excel will highlight those selected cells with that fill color. I'll click on it now and now I can see very easily what the differences are between my left set of data and my right set using the go to special command and row differences. And there you have it. I hope you like what you see. If you do like what you see here, please take a minute to share this post on your favorite social network. I can be found on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, LinkedIn, and YouTube. So I hope you enjoy this. If you'd like to see more, please feel free to stop by my website, excel-bytes.com, and I hope you subscribe. So have a great day and happy excelling.